Hey guys, how's it going? Today we're going to have a quick little video on how to make this Zona device here. There is a villain by the name of Mokhtarok that's in the Zora region in the Water Temple. And he could be a little difficult to beat using that Sage's power. It works, but it's, it's just not the best, man. That guy's power is pretty weak. And um, having to constantly, you know, find him and then use your weapon and swing to, in order to get that water, you know, to shoot out. This right here is just, it's pretty awesome. Works great. I have that little homing card on the bottom with the stabilizer. And after that, I'm going to put a big tire on it, big wheel. And that's going to spin. And then these hydrants, once they're mounted on here they're gonna shoot water at the same time while that tire's spinning so it's gonna kind of just make like a little kind of like a little water ride it's gonna throw water everywhere and make a big mess of water and it's gonna work really really well now you could definitely attach another device or two on here to help with killing uh, the mock rock but I didn't do that I like to be able to go ahead and just kill him myself and if you don't put any sort of laser beams on here or fire emitters or frost emitters you can pretty much walk around this thing and not get hurt so yeah and then here um, I'm showing how you, you know you can break it down and then I'm gonna kind of push these parts a little bit closer over to it and then do the auto build but first I thought I could pick up that tire but obviously I can't so it's gonna go ahead and roll on over there and then I go to my r most recent builds with the auto build and since I have all the parts there it shows that it would be 15 zonite there if you see it I kind of froze the screen but since I have all the parts there I'm not gonna get charged anything so it's just going to build it at the cost of zero zonites since all the devices are already there. But that's how you can auto build it. And as you see right there, since I didn't use my zonite to build it, it has the ability to still kind of fall apart. If you look at everything, it's glued. But whenever you do an actual zonite build, it'll be solid green and one piece, and those cannot fall apart. But in its current stage, you can still take it apart if you wanted to. All right, so now I'm going to travel over to the mock rock and take him on to show you how to use this device. As you can see, I'm at the water temple. Once you defeat the mock rock and any of the other four major boss battles at these temples they will also show up in the beneath world and kind of that little underworld down there where the chasms are there's these open areas down there where it's kind of like a stage kind of setting and there'll be guys down there where you can fight um go back to the fight so as you can see this thing works pretty well almost immediately it throws water on that little sludge shark there and knocks that little purple dude out and we're going to town on him you know I, I got a couple of my sages there actually i got all four of them right now there there is one more the mech sage but i don't have him just yet but we beat him up pretty good now we're all to the kind of second round of them and then this is the part where actually it's really difficult because there's all the sludge everywhere but since the machine is there it kind of just washes it all away and it'll slowly work its way over to him as you can see right there and then almost immediately once it gets close it's gonna knock him out of that little shark dude and then we're right back to hitting him but I made the mistake and I got a little too close to my little device there I hit it, it fell over then I turned it back on and here I'm trying to shoot an arrow to possibly get lucky to hit it when it's kind of flying around but I definitely don't get lucky enough to hit it so it ends up having to run around a little bit more and then it finally does catch up to it and then once again we go at it we almost kill it this round here 
So as you can see, this is only round two of us hitting on him, and we almost kill him. Like literally, we're one hit away, and he snuck out of there. So now we're chasing him back down. We're just about to kill him, probably in the next 30 seconds or so. But as you can see, there normally would be sludge all over this entire area here. And as you can see, there's there's not very much. He's not getting the opportunity to really do much. And um, just like that, he's done. It's over. All right, guys. So if you liked the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and do me a favor and go ahead and do it. It's free. It doesn't cost you anything. You know, go ahead and check out the channel and all the other videos. Um, I'm going to try to post daily. Uh, you know, to get more content out there. I, I gave myself a little bit of time to enjoy the game before I got into recording. But, uh, but yeah, thanks again for watching. Thanks.